okay, three six Pentastar, left bank, two four and six. Always got misfire codes and shit. I just took a little hillbilly water test here. You can see it pour that exhaust valve looks like it's really discolored. Well, you can see it's leaking right out of the seat there. <laughs> we'll fix her up. All right, got the exhaust valves out of our G 3.6 Pentastar here. Like I said, I always wanted to know what was going on because most of these were covered under warranty for the extended service um, campaign that they had going on. Well, now that they're finally starting to get over 150,000 miles or past 10 years, which this is a 2011, we get our first repair. And this has been going on on this bank for quite some time. And it's always the left bank. It's always cylinders two, four, or six, usually four. Well, what I notice is, look at that seat is much wider there than here. Get a light. So, see that's much wider over here. Well, the only thing that can cause that is a bad valve guide, you know. So, and you can see the other side isn't as wide as that. Look how much wider that is. Well, let's stick Mr. Valve in here. <laughs> see, that's wasted. And with aluminum and stuff, I, I can see that being a problem. So, this side isn't as bad. That's not as bad. But like I say, that seat is eight out in there. So we'll uh, we'll fix her up. We'll grind her up and put two new. We'll put new guides in the exhaust and grind the valves. And go from there. Okay, working on my 3.6 Pentastar head, just getting ready to drive the guides in. Got the first one in, got the depth set, got my tool ready to go. So when I drive them in, they're all at the right side, the right depth. So we'll go ahead and do that. All right, we're getting ready to cut the seats. I got the first three done and set. This is the really bad one, the one that had the worst guy. We'll see how she cuts her. Not too bad. Cleaned her right up, nice three angle. And finish the rest and we'll see how she holds vacuum. All right, we're testing her. We got all six valves in. We're holding about 19 inches of mercury. That's actually not a bad drop for six valves, so I'd say we're in good shape. All right, let's vacuum test some tapes here. We'll just do this for the first one. It's about 21, 22 inches of mercury. Turn the switch off. That's pretty good for two valves, so. But no springs or no nothing. Cool, came out nice. And here's my new guides. See, look at that, hardly any movement. We're able to fix the seat. We didn't put a seat in it. Ground out nice. Yeah, that's, that's pretty good. I'm wiggling that all over the place. So we'll put this baby together. So she came out really nice. Should have compression now and stop the misfire code on cylinder four.